Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for July 28th. Today in 1540, Thomas Cromwell is executed. His story has become more popular lately thanks to the wonderful historical fiction from Hilary Mantel and the Wolf Hall books. It's an example of how people did have social mobility in Tudor England. He rose from a poor background to becoming Henry's chief minister, the Earl of Essex, and the architect of the disillusion of the monasteries. During his rise, he made many enemies, including the Boleyn family. While early on he and Anne had been allies, after it became clear that Henry wanted to be rid of her, he helped plan Anne's demise. Ironically, marriage would be his own undoing. When it became clear that Henry's marriage with Anne of Cleves, something Cromwell had arranged because Henry needed the support of Protestant states, it was a disaster. His enemies jumped on it and saw an opportunity to be rid of him. Cromwell became the chief victim of Henry's marriage to Anne of Cleves, beheaded today in 1540. That's your Tudor Minute. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com.